The sidechain input of the Supervision metering plugin is a great tool for comparing audio from different sources together. Let's say in my audio example here, I placed a, a test tone on different tracks. So I have a 440 hertz sine wave. And below that, this track I have set to white noise. So we'll leave those open and I'll just turn down the volume, the monitoring volume in a control room. And let's say if we wanted to see what was going on in that particular track, what we could do is often place the supervision metering plugin either on the control room insert or on the master fader. So once we're on a master fader, we'll go to our supervision and we could see our white noise indicated here but we could also see that kind of coupled with our 440 hertz sine wave. But if I wanted to see these two sources separately, what we could do is utilize the sidechain input. So I'm gonna place the supervision plugin on my white noise channel, and we're gonna activate a sidechain and then we're gonna tell what channel we want it to be side chained into. So I'm gonna say 440 Hertz. So now that we've added our 440 Hertz sine wave in, we don't necessarily see it because right now this is going out to our stereo bus. But if I click on what source that we're actually metering, I could go to my side chain input and I could say, let's do the mix down of the side chain. So if I wanted to see both of these together, I could add another instance of my spectrum curve. So we'll say that this is going to go to my main mix down. So that's our white noise. And this one, I wanted to switch the input and we'll go to our spectral domain and we'll choose our spectral curve. And what I want to do is I make this the active window and we choose this source to actually be our side chain. So now I could look at two or multiple tracks and be able to differentiate between those within one instance. Now, if I wanted these to be overlaid, what we could do is I'll close this instance. Let's go to our source and we will choose under main and side chain, we'll say mix down, main and side chain. So now we'll see that both of these can be incorporated directly into one meter. So our side chain input will be white and the original source track will be green or the color of the track. If we wanted to look at some of the other meters that have this capability of combining and overlaying the side chain from the particular channel. So if we wanted to see other meters that have this capability of overlaying the side chain and the main source, we could come over here and just made a quick preset so we could see not only our meters here, we could have our loudness histogram as well as our VU meter. So we could see our two different sources feeding into our VU meter. If we wanted to check out phase relationship between two tracks, let's say I'll have a track and we'll just listen to it. I'll unmute it. So we'll listen to this track. And I wanted to compare maybe the phase relationships between these two tracks. I can now come over here and let's listen to the other track. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take this track just so we don't hear it at the same time. And I'm gonna just send it to no bus. Let's go to my bottom track here, this forever sorry audio track. I'll open up my supervision plugin on that. We could actually see our, we'll set our side chain input is gonna be set to this track. So as we come over here and play and I adjust both channels, we can see the white, as I draw my fader down, this is the sidechain input is this track and we see that represented in white. And then if I wanted to bring in the bottom track, as I bring that fader in, bring this down. 
And then as I would bring the sidechain input channel, we see that in white, and we could compare the phase relationship between these two different tracks. So as you can see, using the sidechain input, we can monitor different sources. We can monitor the main, and we can do this for the mix down, the stereo bus, left, right, mid, side. We can do that for the main outputs, for the sidechain, and for the meters that we've seen in this demonstration, we can combine and overlay the two sources together. So when you need to compare different audio tracks, using the sidechain input on the Supervision plugin is a great tool. If you found this video helpful, please feel free to like the video and to subscribe to the channel.